I remember Except being this distant. time when Optimus cried over everybody's the one so bitchy about it. <laughs> that's the one that's the one thing I hate about the fandom is that they were so I can understand for kids because you get so attached to Optimus because mm. he's the big he's the big powerful guy and nobody can take him down and then he's just so mercilessly beat in the movie it's like that does make you cry but you have to understand nobody stays a leader forever <laughs> doing something epic, epic here you're supposed to go along with it <laughs> you're the you're the epic comic guy hmm I'm just the guy who dies in like the what third to last episode yeah, it's when the you one. think he's gonna make it through the whole series alive He's like, well, fuck that, I'm dying heroically. <laughs> no! Well, it's the one guy with the blonde hair. His name escapes me, and I know someone in comments is going to, cur is going to actually name him. It's going to be the guy who says, first comment, also this is his name. And then we're all going to rate him down. Just because, even though he said he, even though he said his name, we're going to go like, fuck you, first comment, no more. Yeah, he's the one that went into the uh, source of that one Take really, that really dense sea and shot it at the end, and that blew it all up and saved everyone, and... As he was exploding, he said, um... It's like, so this is the power of spiral energy. Amazing. Or something. And that's also where the, uh, what is it, 926? The heroic time to die? Yes, yes. I still can't believe those twins died in that yeah. whole night. Although they weren't the brightest of them, were they? Yeah. What was it? There was another one of those, uh... There's another one of those bits that was the time Kamina died. But that was spoilers, Kamina dies. We're talking about the two guys at the <laughs> end of the series who die. I don't think anybody cares that Kamina dies. Besides, they've known that for like a year and a half now, maybe, possibly. I don't know how long yeah. it's been out in Japan. But there was something about the time he died. Was it like 918 or something? Yeah, I forget what it was, but then they did some joke tying that to the time the other guys died. It may have been too manly to die at 926 or whatever. Huh. I don't know. I don't know, it's been a while, it was some motivational poster I found somewhere. <laughs> so, whatever. 9 minutes, 18 seconds. 9, Nine minutes, minutes, 18, 18 seconds. seconds. What's that, Vegeta? Happiest time of my life. And then, ironically enough, you go to 918 on there, and it was the happiest <laughs> moment of his life. Epic, mu epic music playing. Epic charge. We're all banding together to take out Mizar. And then the epic fading. Epic fade out. Epic fade out. That's what I was going for. And then epic fade <laughs> epic back fade in. Epic fade back in! You can't do that! You ruined the whole thing! It's like they've been charging out a whole corridor this time. I'm sure one of them's like, Do we have to keep running like this? It's like, oh, oh, by the way, st we're still epically charging! And here's where we ruin the game for everybody else. Yeah, this just completely destroys everything right here. This is, this, you see, okay. this is where we're badly nitpicking the game, even though we realize it is a game. It's like, okay, he creates flames. A flame wall. No one can climb over... No one can get past the flame wall. Except Juno is fireproof, so he can just walk through them. The, fl the whole point is that Lupus is supposedly the only one he can, that can get over him, because he hovers over them, but it's a matter of jumping high, not hovering a distance, so they technically could have all jumped over it, since they can all jump the same height. On top of that... Look at the gap between the flames! I can just walk between them! Yeah, you can fit through- I can fit through them, that's saying something. Going side- inside- uh, going sideways, going- <gasps> And then on top of that, they don't help you! You can shoot through fire! Shoot them from back there! But, no, Lupus is the only one. That's it. So you get to fight Mizar as Lupus only. At least at the end, they kind of give you a reason. Yeah, left as I blew He has really bad off. breath. And we have to shoot him in the Whoa! face. And you know what that says to me? Considering what happened, 920. No, 1020. Whoa! Yeah, why can't I hover? Do you know what happened on 1020? Not really. Give me your face. <laughs> That's uh -huh, I right. I went straight out and got that on Blu-ray. And on, no, I'm saying I'm like so I can shoot you. And I'm saying Woo! I like it doesn't mean you always have to say in the comment that you hate it. I'm just saying I like it. And it was awesome. And I got the Bumblebee transforming case. Actually, the case that transformed. Haha, uh -huh, I shot him in the face. I love that I can actually look at you and just shoot recklessly. There we go. Mizar are down. That was like the easiest fight ever. Woohoo! I'm still shooting. We like weren't even paying attention to the fight. We're talking about something else entirely. 
Transformers Revenge of the Fallen. Yeah. Seriously, it's a case that transforms. And is that it? Have we actually defeated the great Mizar? If TV Tropes has taught me anything, no. No. <laughs> you dare defy the rule of Mizar? Insolent Earth scum, you will regret this as you watch your homeworld torn asunder. He's wearing lipstick. Butt rockets away! And I guess he's pretty powerful if he can take off of a planet without a ship or anything, just with butt rockets. And he beats the gravitational pull of the planet, yeah. and then runs into a meteor, so that's or an asteroid. So that's what is it technically called? I think it's asteroid. Is it asteroid while it's in space, and then it's meteorite if it enters the atmosphere? I think so. Hmm. And then he somehow sets up a base in there. It took him all of three seconds, and now he has a giant base in the asteroid. So this is just a random asteroid. Don't don't know. Don't know why. Don't know. Wait. So he, Malizar has every intention of killing himself when he smashes the uh, asteroid into the Earth. You know what? You know what the funny fact is. You know what that reminded me of. Hmm? It, it's not the funny fact of suicide bombing. That's not funny at all. Stop that, people in the Middle East. Stop that. Read your freaking Koran. There's no. There's nothing good about being that stupidly religious. You just go and blow yourself up. Yeah. Well, I'm just thinking. I don't hate you... Muslims at all. I like everybody. Well, I'm just thinking. Or as I like to say it from Arlie Ermy, I don't hate it. I don't hate any specific person. I hate everybody the same way. Yeah, I'm an equal opportunist discriminator. Yeah. I discriminate against everyone. Are you equally? <laughs> Are you white? Yeah, I don't like you in the first place. Yay! Upgraded but, uh... armor. But. The, Ooh, jet the name for self-destruct in the Pokemon games mm. is suicide bombing. Bakun? No, suicide bombing. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, I looked at that and I was like, you know, in some strange way, I'm happy they didn't translate <laughs> it like that. Because <laughs> self-destruct is already disturbing enough. You don't need to s shout out, Golem, use suicide bombing. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> Boom! <laughs> uh... uh. Hey, you did the Jesus comment, I gotta do a Muslim one. Um, and now we need to do somebody do a Jewish one. Jew beam! <laughs> oh, let's see here. Um, what else was there that we wanted to say while <laughs> we And how many hate comments are you gonna get now? I don't know. How many how many minorities have we made fun of now? Oh, we've done the three main religions. We haven't done Buddhism. Oh, we haven't done black people yet. Well, I'm not doing black people. I don't wanna do black people either. Because they're kinda nice. Yeah. I've known a lot of nice black people. The only thing I hate is stupid people. Stupid people. Doesn't matter yes. if you're white, black, yellow, red, any other color. I don't care if you're fucking zebra striped. If you're stupid, I'm pissed off at you already. Yep. That's pretty much how it works. And I think that electricity needed to be a little lower. As I think you pointed out yeah. last time. Yeah, weren't you going <laughs> to nitpick the fact that Juno's thing goes higher? Yeah, that makes no sense whatsoever, because Juno's thing goes higher, which is sure... Oh, that's right, we're all, playing a game, not nitpicking about society. Yeah. <laughs> I'd forgotten about that. Yeah, back to the game. Um, so yeah, Juno's thing went higher, which was, like, nifty and all, but it makes no sense, because he's standing on the same height platform as everyone else. What really disturbs me is the Mizar too. Yeah, really, that's kind of killed him for all it they knew. Well, whoops, sorry for that, guys. Our bad. <laughs> well, I guess the Earth is doomed, but at least Mizar's gonna blow up when he uh, hits it, because he's not intelligent enough to jettison out of the asteroid at the last second. But whatever. It's kind of a win-win for us, but a win-win-lose. Well, yeah, win-lose we, for we everyone, win, I guess. He wins, and they kind of lose. Tank dog! So we got full armor. Uh, what did I call her? I don't remember. It was something panties. Yeah. Um, Panty armor. And then we have a doggy tank as we dub it Panty Tank. Just so he can laugh and we go like, can you get the reference? <laughs> no, you yes. can't because you're all busy going like, I hate you because you made racist comments. And we're all like, oh, you people. And now we have all, all of our upgraded armor. And because I've you haven't said it that thus far and I was really hoping you would, I will say, that's butts! Okay. I've seen worse on 4chan for racism, damn it. Okay, we have Juno in full armor. We have Vela, the 
fan service character. And Tank Dog, the panty tank lupus. Because it's an in joke and you'll never get it. Unless you read Yu Gi Oh! Damn it, I gave it away! Now, because, was it Jeff? King What's Jeff. the dude's name? King Jeff? Yeah. King Jeff, Jeff gave us this armor, and we need that spaceship to head off to the asteroid. But before we do that, we have to go get all of the uh, tribals that we didn't save or whatever. So we're going to take care of that and put it all together in one quick compilation video. Hopefully. Yeah. Until next time, everyone. We're going to get so many hate comments.